Hey guys, and welcome to another Let's Play. This, of course, is Silent Hill 3, which uh, is a game that I've wanted to cover for a very long time. <clears throat> I have only completed this game once, uh, a fair while ago now as well, I might add. So, I am going to be slightly rusty. Uh, I did want to do the PC version, but the PC version is... Hard to acquire, shall we say, um, unless you want to download a pirate copy, which I didn't fancy that. Um, so we are going to be running the PlayStation 2 version. Uh, this is emulated, of course. Can you stop going into, like, intro mode? That intro cutscene um, doesn't work on this emulator. I've tried uh, a few different ways to get it to work, but... Uh, None of the options or toggles will actually allow it. So I hope this game's actually going to run okay. I have done some testing, and it seems to. Um, this is an interesting game. Um, some people really don't like Silent Hill 3, and some people love it. Uh, of course, everyone like loves the second one, because, you know, Silent Hill 2, you. But this one is a direct sequel to the first game, which uh, I didn't realise until fairly recently, well, until I played it. You actually play as Heather Mason, um, who, of course, uh, was the girl you was looking for in the first game when you was playing as Harry. So this is going to be quite interesting. I did consider getting the HD remakes for the Xbox 360. I know, I know, it's just a thought that went through my head. Because apparently Silent Hill 3 wasn't as bad as Silent Hill 2 on the HD collection, but uh, in the end I just thought, fuck it, let's just go with the PlayStation 2 version, go with what you know, I guess. Anyway, let's go, new game. Uh, action level, I believe, when my friend and I played this, we played on easy um, action, because the fighting in this game is fucking shit, um, that's just the way it is in these old games, and we had the riddles on really hard. Um, but to be honest, I can't really remember what the difference between it was. I'm actually tempted. Should we go normal action and then... <sighs> we could go hard riddles. But I think, what well, let's play through the game once and see how we go on normal. And, uh, yeah, if I fancy it, I might try it on hard. It would be, it would be an interesting experience, shall we say? Ah, and I haven't even started my timer. Bad Titan. There we go. So, yeah, I think we go for normal. Normal. And then maybe, maybe as a stream we could go on hard. I don't know. For whom the bell tolls. That's delicious. Gribbly. Oh, yeah. Well, that's a delightful fellow. Hmm. Seems to be having mental difficulties. But that's to be expected. Um. Game. There we go. Ooh. Lakeside Amusement Park. Looks fun. Where am I? Uh, Lakeside Amusement Park? Maybe? What are you doing with a knife, Heather? And of course, this game throws us right in at the deep end. And, haha, the wonderful Silent Hill atmosphere, man. That kind of foreboding, pulsing soundtrack in the background is just, it just, it's so eerie. It's delicious. A rabbit doll? No. It's a costume. Oh, okay, well that skipped through a bit too quick to read. 
It's a giant rabbit costume. Why would this be here? Uh, oh, I don't know. Maybe it's an entertainer's costume for the amusement park. That would be my guess, Heather. Okay. Now, how do we run? How do we run? There's got to be a run button. There we go. Right. Any goodies to pick up? Ooh. Who's this delightful man? And what's this? Something strange in a cagey box thing. A person? Not quite. Damn it. Oh, you can't re-examine things. What the? What is this? Alright, well, it doesn't look like there's anything we can do here. Nothing to fondle. What is with all this rabbit action going on? And not the good kind of rabbit action. I'm talking about the dead... Well, I suppose that depends on your personal preference. It could be the good kind of action. Uh, okay, well, Heather, let's keep... Ooh, the door... The door's shut tight. Won't open at all. Well, that's no good. That's no good at all. We need to get out of here, Heather. What? Oh, God. Stamina. Seriously? I... Oh, no. Nope. My control pad died. That's right. Windows doesn't tell you when your um, Xbox control pad is running out of batteries because that's too convenient. Way too convenient. Oh, oh, hello, hello, oh, evening, bloody hell, straight off, what's in here, the lock is broken, I can't open the door, uh, excuse me Fido, out of the way buddy, lock is broken, what is with all these, excuse me, whoa, hello, he's a gribbly fella, bloody hell, they, they throw you right in at the deep end in this one, don't they, let's turn that down a tad, why are my controls not my headset? Is that because... It's because I'm wearing them the wrong way around. I thought the sound sounded funky. There we go. That better. Right. So this game like literally throws you in right at the deep end. Now I can't hear fuck all. There we are. Hmm. So, some gribbly monsters straight off the bat. I like it. Oh, hello. It's a rabbit stuffed animal here. The mouth part is stained red. Mm -mm. Almost like blood stains. Disgusting. Mm -hmm. Hello, we're going to be seeing a lot of disgusting things. It's a row of shirts for sale. Well, wow, there's nobody here. I don't think they'd help me at all. That is not the right attitude, young lady. You need affirmative action. And uh, what have we got here? Nothing. Is there anything to grab? Rabbit stuffed animal here. Yeah, 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 yeah. There are boxes of cookies and chocolates on display. I love this kind of stuff, but I don't feel like eating it here and now. Well, take some for the journey. The journey will require sustenance. The lock is broken. I can't open the door. Well, that's awkward. So, nothing to do in here then? Alright. Oh, hello, my gribbly friend. Nice to meet you. Oh, this looks promising. Oh, you know, maybe not. Look, can you leave me alone, please? Oh, shit on a shovel. That was not good. Oh. Tightly shut and won't open. Oh, that's a door. <laughs> of course it is. How did I miss that? Hello, fellas. Just passing through. No need to get all antsy. Oh, bloody hell. Alright, just keep running. Just keep running. What is making that sound? That weird... kind of scratchy metal sound. Is that an enemy? Ooh, a rusty, jagged enemy. That could be interesting. Uh, it's locked. Shit. Um, I guess that's not locked. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, hello. Oh, you crazy. I don't know if we can actually fall off that. I have no idea. Let's walk to be careful. 
Oh, I say. Something's having a wicked good time. Gnawing on the bones of innocent children, no doubt. Fair play, my friend, whatever floats your boat. Anyway, Heather, let's get out of here. Oh, <laughs> all aboard the crazy train. Mm-hmm. Yeah, very weird opening to this game. Kind of just throws you in there. But it was all a dream. Or was it? Hmm. I felt like that this morning, Heather. I know how you feel. Hangovers are the worst. What a nightmare. I love the ambience here. So, uh, there we go. Hmm, what's that locket? Is that something from Daddy? Happy Burger. That's a generic name for you. Let's go to Happy Burger. Oh, that wonderful Silent Hill music. It's so chilled. Dad, it's me. Yeah. Sorry I didn't call sooner. Yeah, I guess I was. Anyway, I'm coming home now. Oh, I didn't get that thing you asked me to. Kids. Okay. <laughs> okay, I will. I love you too, Dad. Awkward. What are you shaking your head at for, fool? My name is Douglas Carter. I'm a detective. A detective? Really? Well, nice talking to you. Bitch. But, understandable, I guess. Hold on. There's someone that wants to meet you. Just let me have an hour. No, half an hour of your time. Yeah, that's not creepy at all, mate. My daddy always told me not to talk to strangers. Wise man. This is very important. It's about your birth. I'm not interested. Hmm. <laughs> Are you still following me? Do I have to scream? Sorry. I'll wait. Were you just going to assume she's going to come back? <laughs> oh, he was following her to the toilet. Uh, oh, that's not good. Um, the mark on this mirror. It looks familiar somehow. What do I know it from? Where did I once see it? And why does my head hurt so much when I try and remember it? Ooh, the mysteries of Silent Hill. Um. Yeah, so there we go. This is where I had my test game earlier. Right, so let's hit up the old save. More toilets. There we go. Five minutes. Hmm. Okay. So creepy McDouglas is outside. Don't really want to go and have a, a chat with him. That weird old detective is out there. So I'm not leaving. Yeah. Well, these toilets don't exactly look. Great, but luckily there is a window that we can escape. Now, I do remember actually, uh, when you complete the game, you get some cool stuff here. Like the laser gun and uh, a few other little bits and pieces. I think it's all the unlockables, but we don't have those yet. So let's get away from Creepy McCreepo. 
He's just gonna like loiter around the girls' toilets. Like a big weird bell end. So we have a door there, okay. Oh, 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 actually, this truck might be where you get the secret stuff that you unlock. Well, that's helpful. Maybe I should walk around it. Never mind. Okay, that just skipped. But how did this car park here? Hmm. How indeed? Best not to question the events that are about to unfold before our very eyes, Heather. Oh. The lock is broken. I can't open the door. Do we have, like, a map? We can pause, which is quite spiffy. Ah, uh, so we have them. I don't have a map of this area. Fantastic. That, that's just grand. Alright, well. If we don't have a map, we don't have a map. There's lots of stuff posted here, but nothing useful. How can you be sure? Have you read it all? The door is shut tight. Fantastic. Okay, Heather, <coughs> Heather, you're not helping with your screwy controls. That's going to take some time to acclimatize to. Uh -huh. Lots of locked doors. Ooh. Well, somebody is here. Or rather, something. Hmm. Ooh. Yeah, I remember I was actually stuck here for a little while. Um, I didn't realise that we could go through this door. Because obviously it's barricaded. Oh, well, that's nice. Convenient place gun on the floor. Fantastic. Oh. Hmm. Kind of, kind of looks like a gribbly flashlight. Get the hell away from me! Yeah, I, I don't think talking, talking to it is gonna do much good ever. Bugger. I love the sound these monsters make. It's fantastic. You did good, kid. What the hell is this thing? Um. Well, I have mentioned what I think it is. Can we? Right. So our gun is empty. Can kind of block. I thought we could. Oh, we can. Oh man, we can shimmy. Oh, I like it. Oh, we can Michael Jackson it up. Kind of. Oh, if only we could moonwalk. Oh, bullets. I got handgun bullets. Excellent. Uh, it's not that I hate clothes, but this isn't the time or the place. Hmm. It's a, a monster. I, I killed it. You did, Heather. You did. You absolutely killed that thing. Which is good. Means you were stronger than the monster. Nothing on the shop counter is particularly... Particularly catches my eye. Well, you're just hard to please. Then I suppose all there is is uh, some pens. So... I thought somehow... We could kick a melee. Not really sure. I don't have the map. I thought we could turn our flashlight on. Oh, we don't have one. It's not on her... Hmm. Her flashlight isn't on her top. Unless I'm just being stupid. Which is 
absolutely possible. So where are we going now? I hope you know where you're going, Heather, because I have no clue. Oh. Oh, hey, pal. Well, you're a funny-looking little fella, aren't you? Um. Well, it looks like we have enemies. Lock is broken. Where's that little T-Rex? Ah, bloody control pads died again. Ah, turn on. Right, one second. I need to sort out my control issues. <clears throat> right, okay, and we're back. We now have full control, I think. Uh -huh. Where is our gribbly friend? What's on, boss? You alright there? You having some difficulties? Yeah, he's fine. Just a regular old puss in boots. Although, it doesn't look like there's anything we can really do here. My friend, you appear to be having problems. Where is this? Ooh. Are we supposed to be here? Oh, hello, friend. What are you doing here? Don't we have to go back and see the detective? Or am I... crazy? Well... Oh, hey pal! Oh, no, 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 no. Really don't want to be playing with you today. Let's try the bakery. Bakery sounds like a good place to be. Ooh, fresh loaves. It's bread. Well, you're certainly perceptive. Oh, hello. Got a pair of tongs. Okay, well, I guess they're uh, useful. It's bread. That does not look like bread. They look like donuts to me. There are no employees around. I wonder where they went. Yes, well, maybe the big friendly fleshlight bloke out the front uh, would be worth asking. Helen's Bakery. Crispy toasted bread right to your very door. Everything on sale. There's a flyer. Mm-hmm. Everything's on sale. Okay, well. So we've got the tongs. Not really sure what we need the tongs for, but... Uh, okay. Can we go in the boutique? We cannot go in the boutique. Calf? I want to go to the calf. Let's go to the calf. Let's get a nice cup of coffee. Unless this guy's going to stick his beastly hands up our ass. Best not think about that. It's locked, of course it is. Sir, please, enough of your nonsense. Natalie shoes. Shouldn't it be Natalie's shoes? Got pick is broken. Sunshine princess. Nope. Oh, hello, there's another one. Okay, I'm guessing there's nothing we can... Oh, hello. Nothing we can do here yet. Which is unfortunate. Maybe we do have to go back and see the detective. Which, you know, whatevs. Makes sense. So let's go back to the detective. Ooh, pallets. Mm hmm. Uh. It's unlocked. Well, that's good. Ooh. Oh dear, we now have snarky beasts. That's unfortunate. Um. We've just gone round in a circle. Oh, that dude's still here. Huh. All right. Uh, so, where did we come in? We came in this way? Oh, that's locked. 
We came in this way, of course we did. Oh. Oh, there's now a lot of dogs in here. That's kind of a bastard. I don't want to go that oh. Ah, this is this is where we wanted to be. Haha, -ha, I remember. I remember things sometimes, guys. I know things about stuff. Right, let's get out of here. Come on, Heather. It's been a long and arduous day. Let's go back. Let's hit up a save. Because it would be rude not to. Let's be honest. Now, let's go see Creepy McCreepin. Or, or, you know, maybe not. That That's also cool. Okay, so I guess when we come back, guys, we're going back into the, the, well, the mall. All right. I thought we had to go back and speak to him. Hmm. Well, if you're looking for an expert playthrough, this is not going to be it. But hopefully we're going to have some fun together along the way. So thank you very much for watching, guys. And as always, till next time.